so fragile as a word It lives, is heard, a heart is stirred The one who made it go to dust And still the forest waits for us At its root, this is a story about what it feels like to have mental illness or to love someone who has mental illness. Maybe, maybe that's for the it's about the writer and poet Robert Lowell and three women who he was married to at different times who also were all very successful writers. There's a connection between all of these things, between mental illness and shamanism and bringing back gifts from the imagination. There's a forest in the story where the lovers go. It is this really cool folk musical that has gorgeous, sweeping melodies, really fun to sing, really fun to listen to. It ain't easy. Oh, oh, oh. The songs become emotional touch points as you move through the story. And it's really marrying the intellect and the heart kind of together. We're going up it and then it's like, there's a forest. But it's not like a, oh, it's like, we made it. Yeah. These women are trying to tell a story about this place where they go in order to create. And still the forest waits for us. No matter who gets to be the one to say, who gets to make art, who gets to take up this space, the forest is there for everyone if we are able to have the time to take a breath and be there. We long the light, we long the dark. The name In the Shade comes from the idea that there's a place that is neither the terrible darkness of depression nor the sunshine of how we wish life could be. It's somewhere in between. We are aware of the pain of life, but not defeated by it, and aspiring toward a more beautiful future, but we are not expecting it. 